here we have it, the Renault Master, all ready for its delivery and pardon me, collection to go to Northern Ireland. Um, just done the pre um, a pre departure inspection. Um, I'm very happy with it, um, so I'm sure you'll be happy with it as well. Looking quite good after a wash, I have to say. So, I think we'll start off by... Uh, right, here, what we've done here, we've put a... Obviously, when they come for the ambulance service, you, you can't use them, so we've put a proper 240 on there. That then goes into this converter here, turns it from 240 to 12 volt, which indeed charges the ledge battery in there, which we've replaced and renewed, and the same with the chassis battery as well. We've replaced and renewed it. Um, let's have a look. So, in the finish, we've got... That there is the signal for your air suspension. That says the handbrake's on, and that there is saying that you haven't got your seatbelt on. Uh, that will be illuminated most of the time. It's just, what, it's just how they are on these fans. Um, buttons here. We've put a few random ones in there because there was loads missing. Um, so we just did that so, so it finishes it off really. Um, I've put the radio, wait, it's asking for the code now. Well, I've put the code on the inspection report, 0402. Uh, that's why we've come out because we've changed the battery again. But yeah, no, the interior is looking nice. It's nice and clean. Engine's running really well. Um, central locking's working. I've checked every door. I think we had to put a new battery in the key, actually. Um, Tire's looking nice. We've changed the centre caps. Um, and the night eater, which I'll get to in a second, is bloody good. Test the alternator as well, make sure that's all okay. Um, da -da 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 -da. Skylight, no leaks. Um, lights in the back. So this one here isn't engaging, that's the only fault I could find. Um, but from my understanding, um, this fan um, is going to be ripped out uh, and lots of the parts recycled, I hope. So come over here to get the night eater on, press that and the air will come out of here um, in about one to two minutes. Um, it'll blow cold for about two minutes and then it'll slowly send a message to the fuel pump and uh, it will ignite the night eater. Here's your control unit. We've got the roof fan. Got that working nicely. So intake and extake, there's two buttons on there. Um, here's the lights for here. They're nice and snazzy. Liking that, they all work. And this is the lights and all about. So you've got that one's not coming on. So, anything else to discuss in here? I wonder. I wonder if I've missed anything. Give that a bit more of a minute. Let's turn it off there. All right. Looking good. Um, we've taken the mountain up there to have a look at the condition of the Campbell. I'm very happy with that, it looks new. Uh, we will get service history at a later date, the printout. Yeah, no leaks, the engine's looking nice and clean. Um, so yeah, happy with that. It's driving really, really well. Smoke coming from the exhaust. It's a cold day today as well, so it's a nice sight. Let's go ahead and turn it off. You can hear the night eater now. You hear that? They are rather noisy, but you hear that ticking there? That's the fuel pump for the night eater which is located there. That's drawing fuel from the main tank. Always love the shots of these are really, really tiny. So, 
we've got warm air. It's nice. Right, let's turn a few of these things off. I'm pretty sure. But yeah, so you'll have to have a play with the buttons in the front um, and, and see what they sort of do. Oh, this is quite a good feature that you'll need. Got an isolator here, kills the battery off. Um, you've got those buttons there, which I believe you hear the air suspension kicking, that's the compressor for the air suspension. Um, the, um, these buttons here combine the leisure battery's power uh, with the main battery if that battery is not sufficiently charged. So, lots of cool features on it. really good condition down there, so uh, obviously the bodywork um, is representative of the price range um, but I think it's good I think it's good overall um, so yeah I'm happy with it I'm hope I hope you'll also be happy with it cheers